Welcome to a new episode on Bocconi TV. Summer holidays are over and Università Bocconi is opening its doors to students. The campus is once again populated with young men and women of different nationalities. New faces pop up and the freshmen launch into new friendships with each other. But, um, maybe someone's still a bit confused. That looks like she needs help. What is she up to? Hey there. Do you need any help? Uh, uh, hi. Uh, well... Are you new to Bocconi? No, not yet. I'm in my last year of high school and uh, I really want to get in Bocconi, but I don't know where to start with my... Number one. You have a lot of opportunities to get information about Bocconi. You can talk to enrolled students, surf the university website, glance through our brochures, and call or visit the International Recruitment Office, where you can get answers to all your questions but they will even arrange a guided tour for you. Got it? Yeah, but actually, I already taken my decision. Okay, good. So now, everything you have to do is in front of you. It's time for step two. Navigate our website and find the online application page. First of all, you'll need to register with your name so you can get your PIN code and your password. Keep track of them because you'll need them throughout the admissions process. Then fill out the application form. It's easy. Just follow the instructions. You will be asked for your SAT exam results. It's an international test that many universities ask their applicants to take. You can find a test center near you. Anyway, if you can't take the SAT exam, you can come to Milano instead and take the admission test at Bocconi. The choice is up to you. Okay, now that you've completed the online form and paid the application fee, you have to collect all the documents required for your application dossier. Do you have them all? Yep, here they are. When filling out the online application, you'll find a checklist explaining all the required documents. These make up your dossier. After collecting all the documents, you'll just have to seal them in an envelope and send the dossier by priority post to the university admissions office to be processed. Mind the deadline. Um, I would actually have another couple of questions. What about fees? Can it be possible to get a scholarship? And what if I need a place in the dorm? You should know that at Bocconi, fees depend on your family income. And in any case, the university provides many opportunities for financial aid. Scholarships, grants, merit awards, low interest loans and study abroad loans are among the possibilities you can apply for. While doing your application online, you can also fill out a specific form concerning financial assistance and housing.
Bocconi offers lots of accommodation possibilities in its dorms. Check for all the details and deadlines about fees, financial aid, and housing on the website. Okay, and now that I've done everything, how long do I have to wait? When will I know if I made it in? After a few weeks, the selection results will be published. They will only be available online. To check the results, just log in with your PIN code and password on the Bocconi website. If you've been accepted, then you can go on to the online enrollment. Did you make the cut? Yes, and I actually got the scholarship as well. Congratulations! You're officially a Bocconi student. Thank you for everything. Well, it's not over yet, actually. The last step to admission is enrollment finalization. You will have to validate your diploma, and if you are a non-EU citizen, you'll need to get a student visa. So, contact the Italian consulate in your country as soon as possible and ask for information about this procedure. Then, once you arrive at Bocconi, you will be able to finalize your enrollment. But don't worry, you won't be alone. The International Student Desk will be your reference point. You can ask them about any issues that have to do with studying at Bocconi and living in Milan. They also organize lots of events to help you meet other students. Now you're ready to start your Bocconi experience. Yes, I'm so excited. Um, well, thank you for your advice. Bye. We hope that all the steps in the admissions process are clear for everyone now. Remember that when you're going through application and admissions, it really helps to sit down and browse the website to read through all the information available. So goodbye and good luck. We hope to see all of you here at Bocconi. Bye.